Hey guys, I got a delivery from Midtown. I'd say about half were dollar books. Uh, some under, some like a dollar twelve, a dollar thirty-seven, and then there were a handful that were more than that. Nothing more than eight dollars a book. Uh, came well packaged, you know, in the bag. My only gripe is you can't seal a bag. You gotta leave them all open. Is there a tape shortage I'm not aware of? But let's get on to the books. Now, I'm trying to fill every issue, every variant of Joker Harley Criminal Sanity. To that end, I found number two, the cover A. And number six, the cover B. And I'll start with DC, then I'll go independent, then Marvel. Uh, some of these are Hughes covers. Superman 11 uh, from the sixth volume. And here is number 13. And 14. And we have 15. This is the Terrifics, number 11. And Batgirl 35. Vampire cover. Now, Indies. I got three Buffies here. All the same issue, uh, but different variants. Pick this one up because I can't say no to Drusilla. Thought this was a cool Willow cover. And a cool Giles cover. Uh, Saga number 50. I picked this up because it must have been either a dollar or under a dollar. Hellboy and the BPRD Seven Wives Club. Uh, Adam Hughes. Red Sonia and Tarzan. Adam Hughes cover. And this is uh, Vampirella number one, uh, volume eight. Cover H Incentive. Uh, homage color variant to a past Vampirella cover he did. Now on to Marvel. And these were all like a dollar or 70 cents. And there were ones I did not have. So Black Cat number one, J. Scott Campbell. Number one, cover C. Trave, or I don't think it says travel, Foreman.
another J. Scott uh, Black Cat 5. Dr. Afra. This is my first Dr. Afra. Number 30, Adam Hughes cover. And finally, Spider Woman, Volume 5, Number 1. This is a Greg Land cover. I think this was cheap, so I picked it up. Uh, yeah, this was a dollar book. That's it. I'll see you guys later. Thank you.